start of the week, anything more than 250 to the front edge, we weren't going to go for the green, and it was like 246. So it was right on the sort of go number, and I knew, I kind of thought before the playoff, like Christian's pretty sure he's probably not going to get home in two. I was actually quite surprised that he got home for two in that second um, playoff hole. So I thought if I could use the advantage of getting on the green too, and it's obviously, it's a pretty hard pin to pitch at. Um, so I thought if I could use my advantage there and, and you know, get it up on the green, that might be, um, you know, helpful. But obviously didn't make the greatest swing there with the second shot. Um, but then from there, you know, it, like I spoke about it with my mental coach that um, we're going to make some bad swings and some, you know, there's going to be some unlucky breaks out there. And if you look back at anyone who wins tournaments, like no one does it perfectly. Everyone hits four shots here and there or, you know, has a bad break or whatnot. So it was just another poor shot. And, you know, thankfully I probably followed up the worst shot that I hit for the week with the best shot I hit for the week to, to force that second playoff hole. And I think obviously with Christian hitting it in the water on the last in regulation and then feeling like he probably had that and then lost it, I, I think that might have put enough pressure on him that, you know, that, that second playoff hole birdie was good enough to win.